All right, guys. Um, just a little bit of a short video. Um, as I said, I might be over in Cebu very soon. Um, if anybody who actually wants to meet up while I'm there, please get in touch. Um, I've got a few things that should make the videos quite interesting uh, once I go over there. There's another. We're actually going to go to Minglanilia this week as well. Um, not in the Philippines, but here in Spain. It's two and a half hours drive, but tomorrow I pick the van up, uh, the car up. Um, I was just at the garage earlier. They're just regassing the air conditioning for me. Um, so I've said to leave it till tomorrow because I've got somebody who might want to buy the van off me. Because um, I don't really want to give it to the garage in case they send it to scrap. But I know it sounds a little bit emotional, but it's, um, it's in all honesty, it's actually, I can't be bothered to take the air the solar panel off the roof and the garage, the guy at the garage will buy it off me if he's got enough money by the end of today. Um, and he'll get the solar panel and all the awning and all the camping gear I spent money on. So he'll end up with a, a camping van. And the, the van he's got, he's got a massive garage to overhaul the engine. He's actually got a two-litre engine he can drop in it. And he knows how to fix it because he's a T4 fan. Um, so... I'm trying to get it so that he has it. So I, I delayed the garage for a day because they said they could have it ready this afternoon. And I said, nah, tomorrow. Tomorrow's fine. Give you plenty of time so you do it properly and no rush because the last thing I want to do is go and find something that's not working and come back again. So much better let them do it an extra day. But that means we're now in the, uh, the realms of things moving forward. And this is, this is one of the things I sort of, been trying to promote is the fact is up until this year it's it's been the first time we've actually been able to do stuff um because we've been stuck in limbo with all the immigration paperwork and everything else uh, but right now we're in the process of april's mother's visit up to um the embassy spanish embassy in manila to process all the paperwork we booked a hotel and everything so things are starting to look up things are starting to look nice um and my apartments in the philippines now are pretty busy there's a few people renting those out do we get in this one here in la mata rented out i'll tell you what the the philippines people not too bad expats in the philippines no bad not bad here five people have said they will definitely 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 want it Da, 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 da. And then they just disappear. Completely bizarre. Um, and I, I I'll just say it's bad manners. That's Because if you're not having it, just say, I don't mind. You know, at the end of the day, but when you say, can you hold it for me? I'll definitely have it. Then not show up. It's just rude. Just rude. Um, but we'll wait and see. But things are doing quite well. As you can see, I mean, we've, I mean, the new car, so somebody asked me how much the new car was. It was equivalent of about $10,000. Um, so paid in cash, done, dusted, nice little vehicle. I'll give you a walk around once I've picked it up. Um, we could have got a newer one, but quite simply, the delay of getting a new one is like months, and I simply just want a car. I want something reliable. Weather's now looking sunny. As you can see that beaming down on me right now. We're getting that sunlight come in. So I want to start doing stuff again. Um, but yeah, I'll be over in Cebu probably next month. Um, no date set yet because um, everything depends on the embassy. I'm actually going there to pick April's mother up. Um, so yeah, if you want to meet up, get in touch. Also, uh, what else have we got going on? Yeah, I think that's a bit of it. Oh, the YouTube stuff is a bit interesting. Because YouTube's changing some of its terms and conditions again. Um, so this channel may actually just suddenly one day have another 100 videos just appear. What it is, I'm going to be pulling off other channels and just throwing them in here. Because um, quite simply, they're going to demonetize those channels because they don't have enough subscribers, etc. So instead of giving it to YouTube for free when they still use adverts for themselves. I'm going to just pull them in here. And they'll, I mean, the thing I'm not saying they were all useful to everybody, but a lot of them are things I found. You know, like when I'm doing something with a Mac and I go, oh, that, 
that's how that works. And now I'll do a video on it because it's I found it useful, like QuickTime. How to record like this with uh, using QuickTime or recording your sque screen with QuickTime. Just those sort of stuff, but lots of lots of little videos that people find useful. Um, is there anything people want me to cover? That's another thing. Any subjects, new subjects? I don't think we've... Uh, I think I've covered everybody's questions because I've been getting a lot of emails recently, and I'd like to say thanks for all the emails. Um, but if there's anything you actually want me to cover in particular, please do. I'll just add it in here, and I'll do your, do a video on it. Same as you can send me an email, and I'll do a video on it. You know, because I know not everybody likes commenting. There's a lot of people that sit in the background. Uh, I know who you are. I can see you. I'm looking at you. <laughs> no, there's a lot of people that actually sit in the background. It's, it's funny when I get some emails sometimes and somebody says they've been following me for the last seven years and you're like, never never seen or heard of you before. <laughs> um, but yeah, I'll leave it there. Thanks for watching.